Let's talk about this. The new iPad Air 12.9, an intriguing product Apple has quietly been developing over the past several months. It's a deviation from the conventional iPad Air lineup, as the 12.9-inch size has traditionally been reserved for the iPad Pro. Recent leaked CAD images have now confirmed the existence of this peculiar iPad, prompting a deeper exploration into Apple's motivations, anticipated features, release timeline, and pricing strategy. Starting with leaks in October from 95 Mac about two new iPad Air models, the larger 12.9-inch variant was initially met with skepticism. However, subsequent reports from DigiTimes and a reliable source, Mink Cho in November, added credibility to the rumors. The details included an LCD screen without the advanced mini-LED technology found in the iPad Pro. In December, Ross Young, renowned for Apple display leaks, hinted at the imminent release with news of panel shipments for the 12.9-inch iPad Air. Mark Garman, the most trusted Apple leaker, further reinforced the launch speculation by confirming that both iPad Air and iPad Pro models, along with the new MacBook Air, would be unveiled in March or April during Apple's spring event. Recent CAD renders from 91 Mobiles, a reputable source for early leaked CADs, have shed light on the design of the 12.9-inch iPad Air. The images reveal a familiar design with a Touch ID button at the top, thicker bezels compared to the iPad Pro, and a selfie camera placement at the top of the long side, deviating from the landscape camera setup many hoped for. Moving to the back, the CAD renders show interesting details such as the placement of the Apple Pencil wireless charger and a unique camera bump layout. The single camera design, reminiscent of previous iPhone models, suggests Apple's decision to maintain consistency rather than introducing additional cameras. Analyzing Apple's potential marketing strategy for the new iPad Air, there's speculation that it could be part of a master plan to strategically position the pricing of the iPad Pro lineup. The rumored high prices for the M3 iPad Pros, starting at $1,500 for the 11-inch model, could be offset by introducing the 12.9-inch iPad Air at a more affordable $800. This could cater to a broader audience with fewer features compared to the Pro models, such as a standard LCD display, thicker bezels, absence of Face ID, and possibly an older M2 chip. The script suggests that this pricing strategy aims to create a tiered pricing structure within the iPad lineup, filling the gap between the iPad Air and iPad Pro models. Additionally, there's speculation about the introduction of iPad Ultra models with top-tier technology, potentially OLED displays, and full macOS software support when connected to a second-gen Magic Keyboard. This speculation, however, remains unconfirmed. In conclusion, while this video provides a comprehensive analysis of the rumored 12.9-inch iPad Air, it also delves into Apple's potential marketing strategies for the entire iPad lineup. The details are speculative but intriguing, setting the stage for Apple's upcoming product releases in 2024. This has been your Apple News Update, and don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel.